Hi lovelies! Don't mind the glasses right now. I'm just like into this nerdish phase at the moment. But this is my November favorites. I've never done a monthly favorite before, so this is going to be a first for me. I did find a lot of things that I actually really did love this month, like seriously love, and I've worn it every single day. So I'm gonna just get down to it and let you guys know what that is. So the first things I'm going to introduce you guys is what I've been wearing on my lips lately. And one of them is the Vitamin Shtick um, Lip Balm. And it's in Kiwi Strawberry Flavored Lip Balm. And I really love this because it's so moisturizing and it's it smells so... It smells really good and that's what I really like. It reminds me of um, the lip balms I used to wear when I was in middle school or high school. I forgot what they're called but if you know what I'm talking about, please comment down below because I totally forgot what it's called. The next favorite is this one right here and it's just a lip gloss from Revlon and it's called Bordeaux. And I really do love this lip gloss because uh, I don't know for some reason it just sticks into my lips and it's just like glossy and I don't know I love it so I wasn't afraid to pick this up and I, I won't be afraid again to like grab another one of these pretty soon I'm gonna be running out of this because I wear it every single day next one is what is on my lashes can you guys tell how my lashes is like super um, up there that's how I like my lashes actually I just like up in your face you know but anyways um my secret is this the Revlon Grow Luscious Plumping Mascara and it's in black and I've used the other one before I forgot what it's called but it's greener without the grayish tint right here it's all green all over but I've used that during summer and unfortunately I kind of didn't like it anymore because it was like smudging and probably because I was in a hot weather but other than that who cares but and then they came out with this line or this one and I was really impressed because I mean look at my freaking lashes like my lashes would never do this with any other mascaras which I totally love and I stand by this I stand by this I got I grabbed backups like I probably have three backups right now but because I really don't want to run out with this and Revlon you better not stop selling these because they're my favorite okay what I'm also wearing on my eyes is this um, eyeliner and it's called Unstoppable from Maybelline and I got the color Onyx and this is a retractable eyeliner um, so as you can tell I still have quite a lot what I like about this is it doesn't run I put it on my waterline and it doesn't run or smudge or anything like that and I have a really really watery line but that's what I really love about this because it doesn't do that and I wear it the whole day through and yeah loving it the next one is what is on my cheeks and it is this Laura Laura Geller blush and brighten in apricot berry and I really do love this because oh, look how amazing this thing is it's like a freaking universe in there <laughs> I'm sorry but this blush is amazing like it just gives like a shine to my um, to my cheeks and that's all I need like I don't need I mean it does give you a bit of color but it gives you like this glow and it's like seriously the best I've ever gotten from Birchbox yeah I got this from Birchbox and it's the best thing I've ever gotten ever and it was in my first Birchbox ever and <sighs> thank you Birchbox for giving me this because I cannot live without it and I don't know if this is limited and I hope not because I really would repurchase this again once I run out and I've been using this quite a lot lately and I still Look at that, you can still see the the huge bump or globe on it, but it's still a lot. And the little goes a long way if you just want that uh, glowy on your cheeks. So I really do like that a lot. Okay, the next two are what's on my nails. Well, one of them is on my nails, but I've been wearing the other one quite a lot lately as well. The, the first one is NARS Poker Face and it's on my nails right now. Look how gorgeous that is. I am into lilac colors. It's my favorite color, lilac, purple. Anything that is lilac or purple it, and it catches my eye, I'll just like grab it and like hold on to it with my life. So I'm really glad that I got this. Um, it was quite expensive for shipping 
to here to Japan, but it was all worth it for this wonderful, wonderful nail polish. So, yeah, it's called Poker Phrase, and this is a lilac color. Oh, I thought someone was at my door. But anyways, the next one is my other favorite, and it's from OPI, and this is my first OPI nail polish ever. And I, I just went on a whim where oh, I'm just going to pick a color other than, you know, a simple color, like a nudish color from OPI. So I got this one, and it's called Midnight Mumbo, and I really, really do love this. It lasts quite a long time. It lasts me for a month, you know, like seriously. You guys don't know how much I love this nail polish. It, it would last me a month, and it would not chip my nails. The only thing, the only thing that is a con is... It's really hard to take off. Like seriously, you would keep like going like this because of the the chunky glitters that's on it. But other than that, I really do love it. But it just takes time for you to like um like take it off, re re removing it, all that stuff. But yeah, that is my favorite. I love 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 love, love this during almost winter time, right? So I'm gonna totally be rocking this during December as well. So the next one is this pond wet cleansing towelette and it's a uh, evening soothe with chamomile and white tea now I really do love this I'm not a big fan of Pond's product I mean I should be because most of my families use Pond's but uh, I just stay away from Pond's because ever since I was young like middle school I tried Pond's because everyone was swearing about it like middle schoolers and stuff like that they were swearing by pond so I used it and what do you know I got lots of pimples like right up here and I really just like that and just like how am I gonna get a boyfriend with the, the pimples on my forehead so later on in life I tried to love ponds again I purchased this one and it's the ponds original and I didn't finish it but I'm saving it to do a review, so I'm just gonna put it in this uh, November favorites of mine. But anyways, um, I really don't like this. It broke me out like crazy, it dried out my face. But when I found this one, I was so happy that it was purple because it's my favorite color. But then I was kind of sad that should I buy it because it says new. Um, I hope it, you know, it does better than the original. So I went home, took off my makeup with it. Um, and hope for the next day that I didn't get a pimple or two or more or a dozen or they have a family in my face and just like having a barbecue on there I don't know anyways so I was really glad that I didn't break out from this and then as weeks went by like seriously I never broke out once from this and I use it every single day so it's my lifesaver now love it okay last but not least are um, eye makeup remover now I'm like a f person that goes to eye makeup removers really quickly because I tend to put more makeup on my eyes than on my whole entire face so um, that's why I actually did love the L'Oreal eye makeup remover at first like for a whole for months now, I, I've been really swearing by this thing. And then they stopped selling it. And I was really sad. This is my like my last bottle, bottle right now. And I'm really sad that they stopped selling that. So, And then I came across this one, which is the Neutrogena Oil-Free Eye Makeup Remover. As you guys can tell, I'm like... Yeah, I've used this quite a lot lately, this whole month. And I bought it this month too. Like seriously, that's crazy. Anyways, yes, I do use this a lot. I really do like it. And it removes my makeup way better than the L'Oreal eye makeup remover. And uh, I'd repurchase this over and over again because it doesn't hurt my eyes. It just, it removes it really nicely. And I don't know, for some reason, it, it keeps my eyelashes from staying up like that. I don't know if it does that with any other eye makeup removers, but it doesn't my l'oreal one doesn't do that but this one does which is amazing love it thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video bye hope everyone has a wonderful week and i'll talk to you guys soon